So we're gonna tighten up the Z-Lock braking mechanics because I saw Emil's piss poor Z-Lock. So let's talk about this. First thing, to really get heel exposure, I like to press the knee and turn it completely sideways. Anytime we're doing a foot lock, we want to remove the slack from the foot. Danny has a lot of flexibility in the foot. Right here is where the slack's about gone. We can even keep going, you know? So we want to remove that slack before we apply braking pressure. So I have my ankle lock grip, I'm gonna punch and drive it across my chest. Now, as I drive across my chest, I start on my wrist bone and I'm gonna come through to my forearm, okay? Now, you can see the heel is sideways. I'm gonna get my rear naked choke grip and I'm gonna focus on bringing my right elbow to my left hip and my left shoulder to the floor. Right there is a finish. And Danny's very flexible, okay? So we can even start removing a little bit more there. But the most important thing is to remove the slack before we apply our brake mechanics, as well as keeping the heel in the center of our chest. So press, drive across. We're focusing on bringing the toes down and the heels up, right? We're not going backwards. That shit's gonna pop right out. I'm rotating across my body, there's my finish. It's like I'm uh, fucking scooping dirt and throwing it over my shoulder with a shovel, all right? So fix your shitty Z-locks, people.